let's talk about the successes. What are the characteristics of emotional intelligence? How do people show up in ways that help them succeed? This is a great area to focus on. One of the things that highly emotional, intelligent people do is they can isolate failure and success. So when they have a failure, they can actually examine it and learn from it and figure out what they would like to do differently next time. Um, when they have a success, they don't just go, great, woohoo, and then move on. They actually sit back and look at it. What did I do really well? What did I, um, what do I want to repeat? Where are the strengths that I saw in this? I had a gentleman that came to me. He was uh, new to entrepreneurship and he was doing some real estate flipping. Okay. And he did this um, transaction or he put in this bid, excuse me, and he, he didn't, he didn't win the bid. So I said, okay, great. What'd you learn from that? He's like, well, I just, I didn't, I didn't get the bid. I said, okay, but did you sit down and, and really kind of pull it apart and figure out what went well, what didn't go well? Do you think that there were some things that you did really well that you can repeat? And are there things that, you know, you could identify so that you know that when you're going against maybe another institutional investor, that these are things that you could do differently when you're going through another individual investor. These are the things that you need to look out for. So when you have that, you don't just go, oh, it was a failure and move on. But you go, oh, this is what happened. This is what I can do with that. And this is how I can grow. And you do the same thing with successes. 